In this Gauteng based company, the telecommunications technicians installs, maintains, and tests telecommunications equipment. Although this company doesn't offer it, he's also qualified to repair equipment. Telecommunications, also known as telecoms, includes information transmitting technologies such as telephones, wired and wireless, microwave communications, fiber optics, satellites, radio, television broadcasting, and the internet. Another team member, the telecommunications engineer, designs telecoms plans for clients and meets with these teams to take them through the design. The team includes the telecommunications technician who will do the actual physical installation of the equipment and cabling. For example, the technician may install the equipment that provides internet connectivity for the business, enabling all employees to be connected anywhere in the building. The technician installs the access points in the client's premises. These are the antenna that provide wireless connectivity. This is known as point-to-multipoint -point connectivity. In other words, multiple points within the client's premises contain access points. This is known as the LAN, the local area network, the area inside the client's premises. This takes care of connectivity within the building. He also installs a microwave dish which looks like a satellite on the high site or roof of the client's building to pick up frequency from an existing microwave dish in the area. This is known as the WAN, the wide area network, outside the client's premises. It's also known as point-to-point -point connectivity, bringing connectivity into the building by connecting to an external point or the microwave dish. He tests that there is wireless connectivity throughout the premises using an app on his phone. All employees will now be able to use the internet on their laptops and phones and other devices from anywhere in the premises. The technician is responsible for support and maintenance. For example, if the client experiences connectivity problems, he pings, which means he sends a message to check for a response. If there is no response, he logs it with the relevant service provider, such as the company who supplied WAM, Wide Area Network Connectivity, for further investigation. He runs other tests, like checking for a packet loss, sending a message that says hello. If the client only, for example, sees the double L's, then he knows there is a signal loss. Or he tests problems like voice quality issues, such as cross lines or speech distortion. From this, he diagnoses what needs to be repaired. This career is classified as a trade and the minimum requirement is a 40% pass in maths at grade 9 level or a national certificate vocational level 2. You can then do an apprenticeship or various learnership programs. A good telecommunications technician needs to be handy and practical and have a good knowledge of telecoms technologies. This is an in-demand skill in our rapidly developing technological world.